Meanwhile, North Korean leader Kim Jong Un is revamping Pyongyang's weapons development program, replacing older officials while giving prominent positions to younger officers. Our Son Jung In, Song Ji Sun reports. At a time when North Korea appears to be developing more high-tech missiles and nuclear weapons, it seems like its leader Kim Jong Un is replacing more older officials with officials who are younger by at least a decade or more. The North State Korean Central News Agency reported Tuesday on the officials who accompanied the young leader during a recent visit to a munitions factory. That list includes Kim Chun Sop, and his name appeared after those of Workers' Party secretaries Choi Yong Hae and Kim Yang Gon. The location of his name is an indication of his growing power. Although the report did not state the new official's position, there is speculation that he is the deputy minister of machinery. Widely believed to be a euphemism for weapons development, Kim was promoted to North National Defense Commission earlier this year, and has seen his career take off since Kim Jong Un took power in 2011. Before that, he was a regional official in charge of a military weapons factory complex. He is believed to be in his late 50s, whereas his predecessor was in his 70s, and he is just one of the many new key aides who have replaced older officials in recent months. Experts say the shift in the weaponry sector to a younger group of officials will continue to meet Kim Jong Un's goal of expediting and reinforcing long-range missile and nuclear weapons development. Song Ji-sun, Arirang News.